Hey, it's Greg Wartko with Green Industry Pros, reporting from the 2014 Kubota National Dealer Meeting at the beautiful Gaylord Opryland Resort and Convention Center in Nashville, Tennessee. Kubota has well over a thousand dealers in the U.S. and Canada, and nearly every single one has sent personnel to this year's event. There are a lot of reasons why so many dealers wanted to attend the meeting this year, the biggest of which being the unprecedented 92 new product model introductions. Some of the new models represent additions or improvements to existing product lines, such as the three new models of commercial zero-turn mowers, each powered by a Kawasaki engine. Those mowers complement existing models powered by Kohler engines. There's also a new, slightly more compact, high-end residential zero-turn mower designed in price for that lucrative under $4,000 prosumer market. But many of the other introductions represent not only new products, but new product categories for the Kubota brand. For instance, the M7 series represents Kubota's first crack at the big ag tractor market. Similarly, Kubota has decided to insert itself into the skid steer loader business. We tried dodging some raindrops to get some insights from a Kubota skid steer expert. Hey, and another new product at this year's uh, Kubota National Dealer Meeting is a new skid steer. And John, the product manager, is here to walk us through it. Excited about this new machine, huh, John? Oh, yeah. Uh, a lot of good features on it. It's a, uh, you know, it's a well or really an, an older market, well matured market, and we're just starting to dip our foot in it, but we have a wide wide variety of standard features and options on this machine, and I think we'll be very competitive in the market. Ben, that's a question I had for you. You know, Kubota introduced a track loader a few years ago. That has been very successful. Yes. The skid loader market, a mature market, lots of competitors. What would you say are two or three features on your skid steer that could be a real game changer for a landscape professional? Well, two-speed travel. Okay. Uh, two-speed travel is standard on our machines, and they're optional on uh, competitive machines. Mm -hmm. One thing, high flow. We're going to offer high flow on both machines, which is very important for landscapers when they're operating rakes. Right. And then lift capacity. Okay. On our machines, we have a lift capacity on the uh, 65 of 1,950 pounds rated operating capacity and 2,690 pounds on the uh, SSV 75. Okay, very good. And there's two models coming out this year? Yes, sir. Two models, uh, hand and foot controls, SSV 65 and SSV 75. Okay, and looking to expand the line as you dip that toe and start moving forward? Yes, uh, next year we're going we're to expand the line uh, right. next year about this time. Very good. And so far, I mean, the dealers seem really pumped. What have you been hearing from the dealers who are here you know, learning about this firsthand? Very excited. Uh, very excited about it. Glad that we've uh, come out with the machine because it's really going to complete their construction equipment line with our excavators, our SVLs, or track machines that you mentioned earlier, and now the skid steers. Very good. Well, I appreciate you talking to us about it, and good luck with the, with the machines in 2015. Well, thank you. Okay.